Check out my business website too. What is Office Scripts? It is an online serverless code in the cloud similar to Azure Functions. So, it brings macro level ease of use coding to the cloud for the citizen developer. In this video, I show you how to add a dialog box to your Office Scripts code. We make use of the existing data validation function that has its own dialog box. The code can be found on GIT Hub. I supply the URL at the end of this video. Let's have a look at the demo. In the workbook online I click the dialog demo 1 button. You can see a dialog box appears. Because I have set its duration to 5 seconds we can see it disappear after those 5 seconds. Let's now have a look at the code. In the main function we set a variable for the worksheet. You must first insert a call to the dataval function at the start the your main function. You should, then, insert your code. Immediately after that there should be a call to the function called clear dataval. We then specify the duration of dialog box. We are doing that with the function called sleepy. So, let's have a look at the individual functions and see what is going on with them. First of all we look at data val. What we are doing is setting data validation on cell C2. It doesn't have to be that cell. It can be anyone. Then we are clearing previous validations to avoid conflicts of validations. This is not mandatory. Then we are setting up the text of the dialog box. You can, of course, set that as a variable thus making the title and message dynamic. After that we are displaying the dialog prompt itself using the setPrompt function. So, now, looking at the clear data val function we can see we are declaring some variables. Then clearing validations. Then setting a value to null in a particular cell. That implements the clearing of the dialog box. You can find this code and another example at the GitHub URL supplied at the end of this video and in its description. Check out my business website too.